All right, what's good, everyone? So the Halloween event is just about to drop. We have a couple of new things for you guys. And one of them is a fruit rework. If you haven't seen the Twitter screenshot, y'all wouldn't know. But if you did, you guys know what fruit it is. So the fruit is going to be a revival revamp. So the revived fruit just got a whole revamp and it's now called Ghost. And let me tell you guys, the Ghost fruit is looking really, really good. Y'all are about to see. I'm about to showcase it to y'all. There's also a couple of other things I'm going to showcase after the fruit. And I'm going to explain the event to y'all in general. So let's get to it. So one thing I want to explain real quick before I showcase it to you guys is that this fruit has a passive and you guys are going to be really hyped about this one. Now watch this. Watch what happens when he kills me. Your boy revived automatically. You have one extra life when you have the ghost fruit and you revive with half HP. It's pretty good. So watch. I'm going to do the same thing to them right now. 
He also respawns with half HP. All right, revive fruit. Definitely got the love it deserves. The devs went crazy on that fruit. The fruit looks amazing and it's OP. And basically, if you guys didn't understand, the V ability, the ultimate, every time you use it, the clones will copy your moves. Every single fruit move that you use will be copied. If you use the F, the Z, the V, anything will be copied. It will also use the same weapon you use. If you equip your weapon, it's going to start meleeing with their weapon. And the same thing applies to your fighting style as well. If you use Sanguine or God Human or any other fighting style, it will use the same style i showcased it in the video but just in case you didn't get it there you go there's also a couple of other things that got added this halloween event i'm gonna showcase it right now basically during this event there's gonna be cursed chests that spawn around the map and they're black chests so you're gonna tell the difference once you see them and i'm gonna show y'all one right now back up boy so we got the black chest right here each chest drops around 20 to 25 bones and it spawns two to three enemies and each of those enemies drops six to eight bones each and i'm gonna show y'all right now Oh, y'all gotta piece them up, though. They not weak. All right. So they drop six to eight bones each. And on average, it's gonna be 40 bones per chest every five minutes. And then once you're done collecting those bones, all you have to do is go to the Death King NPC at the grave. Talk to him. And then you can use those bones to get a stat refund, which costs 150, a race reroll, which costs 300, and it's a random surprise, which costs 50. And the random surprise consists of a couple of different things. So you can get an 8% chance of getting a fruit, or you can get money, frags, or two times EXP. So test your luck right now. Right, and last but not least, we have a new C event. As y'all can see, you're getting attacked by haunted sharks, a haunted ship. A lot of stuff is going on. And these NPCs also have a chance of dropping the ghost fruit, so make sure you guys take advantage of that, alright? Right, guys that's gonna be it for this event i hope you guys enjoyed there's still a couple more updates coming this year if you haven't seen the roadmap already i'm gonna post a screenshot right now it's on our twitter so make sure you follow so you can see our future plans for the updates and stuff but anyways we still have an update coming in november which is gonna be the thanksgiving update and we still have one more coming in december which is gonna be the christmas update and yeah i hope you guys are excited for those this halloween event is just a small one with like a c event and a ghost fruit revamp hope you guys enjoy though and make sure you get a grind, do you feel me? Happy Halloween, smash that like button. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.